Good morning, fans of Privateer FX. Coming at you on Wednesday, FOMC day. Um, it's 7 p.m. Swiss time today, so we got a little ways to go. Let's just take a look at what the hell is going on here. Uh, UK inflation just came out. That was hot. Euro sterling. Shifty day yesterday. <clears throat> Euro sterling went up to 88.38 on basically nothing. We just sold some here um, at, at 90 after the numbers. Uh, we feel like this can head back lower. Uh, just sort of a day trade as per usual. Um, very curious price action on yesterday. It's a very, very bullish bar out of nowhere. Took us by surprise. Also, what else took us by surprise? Gold went way lower than we thought it would. Um, all the way down to 36 gold. So now that's a pivot. Uh, if you're long, uh, you kind of have to puke through that. That was a big day in gold on basically nothing. I guess rates went higher. You saw rates up to 360. We own some bonds here. We think these rates uh, are going to turn today. We think they're either going to do nothing or raise and then pause. Um, so we feel like rates can go lower uh, and the dollar can get hurt today. Let's take a look at dollar yen. Similar to gold, went a little bit further than everyone was comfortable with. High last night was 77. Um, not much to do with this now. We just have to wait and see. Um, for FOMC. Obviously, if he's dovish, this is a pure play. Uh, you, your left hand side, if he's hawkish, your right hand side. Let's look at Dollar Max. Talked about this 1929 to 19, um, 1919 to 1940 area. We did get a high of 23. Dollar Max looks like she wants left. Um, if he's dovish today, this can go a lot further very, very quickly. So careful on, on Dollar Max. We talked about Euro Norway yesterday that it could go lower. It did go lower. 11.28 the low. Uh, crude jumped. 70 is going to be resistance first couple of times. You can probably sell this sort of. 69.95 to 70.45 first couple of times, but go, uh, crude looks like she's turned. Um, but a lot has to do with what equities are doing and and what the general global economy is doing. But gold looks like I mean oil looks like she's turned. I'm not going to go into too much detail here at the European Open. Uh, you know, we just own a little bit of, of sterling here after the super hot inflation numbers, 10.4 inflation. We were looking for 9.9, .9, uh, so euro sterling might be able to head left a little bit. Otherwise, we just have to wait and be patient um, for FOMC. So with that, wish you good luck, and I'll see you tonight, 7 p.m. Swiss time for uh, the FOMC statement. Ciao.